Hey! Oh! Whoa! Let's go, go, go! Hi guys, welcome back to Andy Blarg. Alright, don't you dare go into the Valley of Windworks! I got orders to keep everyone out! They're not part of the new black. Give me a look that makes me think you're gonna try to get in. Okay then, you'll have to battle me for it. He's like, I don't like that look in your eyes. Hey you! I'm gonna smack you with my last thing time! Look at my glam, yo! Tis a woman! Well, let's see how you handle a flame wolf to the face! It's super effective! Well, not really. Oh no. <laughs> Go Zarya! You can do it! Ah! Oh, Zarya's gonna die. Use the rock smash! You can do it! By the power of Mother Russia! Huzzah! Mother Russia. In Mother Russia, Glamyo is killed by Machop. Well, that worked. Good job, Zarya. <laughs> oh man. Zarya is gonna be the best HM slave. Not just great, getting owned by some kid. But you can't do a thing if I lock myself in with my Windward Works key. My no cord and I have the only other one. Thank you for telling me that. Kerchunk. Well then, let's go and get the other key. I'm gonna try and make these episodes shorter. I just feel like my episodes are a little too long, you know? And people are just getting bored with it dragging on and on, so I'm like. I'm going to- oh shoot, where did I end up? Enough arguing, hand over that sweet honey. Do as you say, Team Galactic, we'll have that honey! We must have the honey! We must give it to the boss for his beautiful toasts. We need only your honey. Let's go. Let's go, Team Galaxman. What are you gonna do to me? He even makes like a fart noise when he's released. Merida! Kill them all! Merida's too strong. Yeah. I think I'll take it easy with level grinding. I mean, I probably don't need to. I might as well just play it like a normal person, right? I don't know. I mean, I'm pretty good level right now, right? And. I was told that this game is built so that you don't ever have to level grind. I just like level grinding. <laughs> this is why I'm gonna be stuck as a grub forever. So lame. Yeah, it didn't weaken me at all, bruh. He didn't even do anything. He used like one scratch attack and that was it. Oh, Luxio is so cool. Every time I see Luxio though, I think of Clement's Luxio from the anime. Because it was awesome. That was a really cool episode when he sees like this old Luxio that used to be his Shinx and then ends up catching it and then it turns into a Luxray and then Ash has this epic battle with it and it's like, yeah, that's the way you do it. I want a promotion. I didn't read the rest of what he said. The brass tough, like really, really tough, tough than I can put into words. I know a lot of words. He's an English major. I, they seem to have forgotten it. The works key. How do you just forget the works key? Do you just like let it go? Because that's not very smart. No wonder they're gonna be... My oh, sweet honey. Their dress for saying didn't make a whole lot of sense either. <gasps> Ooh, I want a Vespa Quinn. I need to have Vespa Quinn. Mm. Okay, let's see if I can catch something cool. Let's see if I can catch a female... What is this? Sweet scent. You know what? Eh, wait, wait a second. I gotta know if it's possible to get more. If honey on a tree, check back later. If it is, it's quite often a rare Pokemon. Oh, this is the generation that introduced Rose Rose Raid. All right, let's see what happens. Uh, so do I just like come back later? Or? Is this like the whole you leave and then you go back in and suddenly it's there or do I have to legit wait like real time? Uh, honey. No. 
Okay, I guess I'm gonna have to wait until I get done with the windworks. Then I'll come back. I'll, I'll probably end the episode on that. Let's go. Let's go save the people. Hey, it's a Shellos! It looks so goofy! <laughs> Look at its face! Just, hey, I am Shellos! <laughs> it's adorable. I love it. But not enough to catch it, sorry. So now I found a Buizel and a Shellos, but... I don't need more. Uh oh. No. No. Okay. Very good, Merida. Don't die to such a worthless move. Ying. Yee. Okay. So now I know there's a shell loss here. Open. Hi. Hey, I found the key. Locking the door is meaningless! I am the loser in this after all. Ooh, this music is like... One time I met a fly guy. He was my tie. <clears throat> no fun, this is proper work! Yeah, stealing stuff, that's totally proper work. Oh, that was it? Wow, that was easy. I gotta fight all of them, though. That's my rules. That's our mission. Why do you gotta get it from Valley Windworks? Just, there was a patch of Risu in the patch of grass right outside. You could've just caught one there. And then it would've been fine. These people don't understand the basics of the Pokemon universe, do they? I mean... If you're gonna let the fi let the Pokemon fight each other to death, I'm pretty sure Peter would be f uh, Pokemon Peter would be fine if you just used them to electrify stuff. It'd be like union workers, you know. I remember we talked about that in the previous episode, but it's just like you get a bunch of electric types, get them to shock a battery that charges the the city in pretty much, and then like. Give them normal breaks, let them have like some fruit and some like berries and then juice or water or whatever so that they can recharge themselves. And then, you know, just keep doing that over and over and over. It would just be like a normal day's work for the Pokemon and then the Pokemon would be happy, you give them a nice place to live. I'm a genius. Okay, I can't battle anymore. They're gonna take away my Pokemon from messing this one up. She went, the man was smooshy. Hi! Excuse me, I'm one of Team Galactic's three commanders. No, wait, that's one of four commanders. My name is Mars. Hmm. Mars, are you gonna make chocolate bars? And Skittles? Wait, did, did, did Mars... Did Mars make Skittles? Oh, I don't remember. I think they did. They made something other than just chocolate bars. I did a whole report on chocolate making when I was in uh, high school. It was awesome. Da 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 Zubash, you're dead. I'm like at level. I'm really glad that I. Oh, what? Okay. That's illegal. How do you have toxic already? That's not fair. Oh. What do I think I'm doing? I'm about to revenge kill it for you friggin' toxicing me. That's like a late game move. That's like the most potent, potent status move ever used in stuff. You see, I I am subscribed to a guy named Come on, Buzz Lightyear, let's show him who's boss. I'm subscribed to a guy called Pimp Knight, and he does a lot of like competitive competitive battling and stuff, and he talks about competitive sets and stuff. And so from watching that, I have learned. I should have seen that coming. I I've learned more about like competitive play just by watching that so even though I don't know everything I do know stuff come on Brugly oh my gosh what have I done I am gonna lose this fight oh Brugly you're too bulky Syndrome get out here I'm sorry Buzz Lightyear 
So this is where all you people are probably cringing in the background saying like, Oh, you should have made him evolve! I'm just like, look, I'm sorry I didn't make him evolve, but... SPARK TIME! St Holy! Okay! That was not cool, Perugly. How dare you do such things to- oh, and there's a mandatory berry. Oh boy! Why is your scratch attack super strong? It's a scratch attack! Oh, what do I do? Luckily this isn't a Nuzlocke, I finally had something faint. Come on, Piplup! Oh, Piplup's out. I don't think Piplup's gonna really live in this one. Nope. <laughs> I'm getting swept by a Perugly. <laughs> There's nothing more insulting. Oh, Merida! Merida! Oh, no. No, dang. Hey, Too bad Toxic is gonna kill me! Mm, yes! Come on, get the get the experience, please. Yes! 666, huh? Well, isn't that... Oh, wow. Do you see why I want to level grind all the time? That was literal garbage. Hey, at least she was nice and said... I might lose to a child, will you? But no matter, we've collected plenty of electricity. Again, just use the Pokemon to collect electricity. I mean, if you're evil guys, you wouldn't even care. You would, you should just capture Pokemon and make them use electric moves for you. And if you're evil, then you don't have to worry about being a good person and giving them a break, right? Tingalactic. It was for creating a new universe. How dumb can you be? Look, you can get ex you can you can burn stuff. You you can get energy from 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 fire types. You can get energy from water types. You can get energy from from flying types on your own windmill. Just make flying types. The people in Pokemon are so stupid. And Merida's gonna die. I am so sorry, Merida. <laughs> okay, good job. But they're so dumb. I mean, you have these infinite resources of Pokemon everywhere. Get a bajillion Pikachus and Pachirisus and then boom, they're gonna charge it. And then if you, like I said, if you give them food, give them water, give them a nice place to live, and, then, and you treat them with respect, you don't even need to treat them with love, you can just treat them with respect. Hi, Looker. Yes, it is what she says. But seriously, think of all the, it's like, how could Pokemon ever have an energy crisis in such a thing? And you might think, oh, but then you gotta enslave these Pokemon. Well, we're already enslaving these Pokemon so that they can fight for you! It's like, come on! Use some logic! See, vote for me, vote for me, Andy Blarg, for president of the Pokemon universe. You will never have an energy crisis, and you can ensure that the Pokemon that we use to create an energy create this clean energy, will be well treated with perfect living quarters, with perfect pro provisions and things. Vote for me, Andy Blarg, for Sinnoh President 2017. 2018. A vote for me is a vote for clean energy. For clean and law-abiding energy. Alright, did I get anything? Did I get a prize in every side? No. I guess I really do have to wait. How long do I have to wait? Do I have to wait like a legit 24 hours real time? Because if I do, that's gonna be really upsetting to me. Uh, anyways. You know what, I, I actually need to go to the Pokemart. Haha, <laughs> Nuzlocke, I wasn't able to do this. This is nice. I'm gonna get some Pokeballs. Dun, 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 dun. I need Pokeballs, give me an antidote. Cause I'm going to need those. Hey, who else remembers how much I hate paralysis? <laughs> that was like my thing in uh, in the Emerald Nuzlocke. Paralysis m enrages me. What do you got? Ugh. Ooh. I'll take some of those. I don't need a heal ball. Heal balls became really irrelevant later on. Cause you catch the Pokemon, they're already instantly... <laughs> 
Oh, I don't know. Let's move on, though. What do you gotta say? Yeah, I did that. No, I don't think I have any. Let's fight. I need to get my mind after. Uh, I... Stupid tingle act dick. <laughs> hey, it's a ponyta. Bring it on, lesser ponyta. Ponyta is a high exp giving. Oh, so that's the way you want to play, huh? Well, my tackle's better because I am stronger than you. What I say? Level nineteen. Ooh, man, I'm suddenly really hot. Man, her attack got really high. Ooh! Hey, that's actually a good move. You know, I used to think Stomp... Okay, actually, hang on. Uh, 65... Yeah! I used to think Stomp was, like, whatever, but now I realize that Stomp is actually really useful because it can make people flinch, which makes it really trolly. Dude, I'm gonna love my Merida forever. I get very attached to my Pokemon. Pachirisu. See what I mean? Pachirisu. I don't know. I am. I am just infuriated now at myself. For. I don't know. There's no mountain here, but I'm dressed to hike. Yeah, it makes you weird. He's like deep in thought. He's like, hmm, if I were to hike up a hill, would that still make me a hiker? Merida, you cannot handle this. I need to make my Buzz Lightyear gain some more levels. Buzz Lightyear of Star Command. X Special Defense. You know, I'm gonna take this time to level grind. <laughs> Shell <Shall> off. <laughs> It's so adorable. It's so funny to me. Hi! Alright, let's see if we can actually get to wherever we need to go. I don't really know where I'm going, though. Eterna? Oh. Okay. Camper Zachary has an A-palm. You know what, I think I'll actually just fight this person and call it good. Because... I've been playing for a while, so I'm just like, I don't want to make it too long and dragging on-ish. Roselia. Not Rose Raid, though. You foolish fool. I don't even know how to get a Rose Roselia. I think you gotta, like, use a stone, but I'm not sure. You guys act like I know everything, but I don't. I'm of course talking to the voices in my head. Yee! Okay. Yeah, so I'm gonna call it an, a quits here. Cause I don't want this to drag on mercilessly as it already has. But first, ah, nothing. I was hoping for something. Oh. Anyways, thank you for watching today's episode. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day and that I wasn't too boring. And in the next episode, we're gonna, I guess we're gonna go to Eterna City. So thank you and good night, everybody.